I'm Tiam Seng. I'm going to share with you how to change the position and orientation of a site. The position and orientation of a site is like a local coordinate system. Elements like site and zone has their own local coordinate defined by the position and orientation attribute. By default, the position is east 0, n 0 and up 0. The orientation is y is north and z is up. When you are merging elements within a zone together, this local coordinate system becomes important. Sometimes, when we put them in a different coordinate system to where we want to merge them to, this will become a problem. In this video, we are going to show you how to change the local coordinate system of a site. Here we see the position and orientation of the original site. And what we want to do is to move the equipment to a new site with the position and orientation set to the default of E0, North 0, Up 0, and Y is North and Z is Up. I will start by creating a zone. When you are doing such an operation, make sure you back up the plan. Use a copy of an element instead of using it. In this way, you can check the element before and after the modification. You can see there's a difference in the position and orientation of the equipment that we copied. To restore the equipment to the correct position, we need to modify the new copy equipment position and orientation. For this, I'll use the command window. Navigating to the original equipment, I will check the position and orientation with reference to the world coordinate. I copy this position and modify the copy equipment with this position. I do not have to put the with reference to world because the site and zone of this copy equipment are by default at the same position. Now that we get the thing to the correct position, you can see that there is also some differences and this is caused by the orientation. Let's do the same for the orientation by QORI with reference to WORL. Again, we copy this orientation and set it in the copy equipment. So now you can see that both equipment are exactly in the same position with the position and orientation of the site modified. Hope you find this tip useful and see you again soon. Bye!